Hi, and welcome to PT Dance Educational Videos. Today what I'm going to talk to you about is the reasons why we should be having your whey protein pre-training other than post-training if you have only one option between the two. Ultimately, we need to be having your whey protein or BCAs before training and after training. But why is it that the new information states that having it pre-training is more important than having it post-training? That's what we're going to be talking about today. So this is the way it was explained to me. If you were to drink sugar water, do you actually take the water, put it in your mouth and drink it, then add the sugar? That just doesn't make sense. So why train, put your blood into your muscle, and then add the protein? Wouldn't it be more efficient if you put the sugar in the water and then you drink the sugar water? By doing that, what you should be doing is putting your protein into your body first, then delivering the blood to your muscle with the protein in it during exercise. So I guess that what we're trying to say here is that you should have your whey protein about 45 minutes uh, to half an hour pre-training. Don't forget, it takes about an hour for those amino acids to peak in your bloodstream. Yes, the protein is digested through your stomach, in about, say, 10 to 15 minutes. But by the time all those amino acids uh, get absorbed in your lower intestines and peaks in your bloodstream, you're looking about an hour down the track. And this is another reason why it's important to have it pre-training than post-training. So in conclusion, the new information states that we should have our whey protein about 45 minutes pre-training and then ASAP straight after your workout. So have it and block your workout. So bracket your workout with two serves of protein. Now what you can do is that, remember, if you're taking a pre-training supplement, it might not be in your interest to mix that with your protein. And if you are taking a pre-training supplement before your workout, there probably are BCAs in there anyway. So because there's BCAs in there, you've got your amino acids that makes protein, so you don't have to have your protein pre-training. And this is why pre-training supplement companies are quite smart. They already put your BCAs in there. And that's where you get a lot of your growth from. So if you're taking a pre-trained supplement, you can have that before your workout and just have your protein after. But if you're not taking a pre-trained supplement and just having uh, protein, so if you're just doing exercise, good nutrition, and just having a whey protein supplement, then don't forget to bracket, bracket your workout. Try this in your new workout. Talk to you next time.